Okay, so today I'm wearing Ellenville's Arrow, a light bursting beard if anybody cares. And this is a synthetic piece that's open wafted in the back. Um, so let's talk about this. So at first I had a nylon wig cap underneath with wig grip, and then I had it up in a top knot. And I was doing um, insanity, so doing a lot of high intensity, jumping around high knees, things like that. And it flopped around and it was falling off, fell right off. So then I took off the nylon wig, crap, wig cap and um, I had uh, just put the wig grip on and then put this in a ponytail. Now in certain lighting, I didn't use a headband. Um, I mean, you, you could, it'll look better. But I just wanted to see if just the wig grip would keep it on. So in a ponytail, it would stay. My concern would be, is the ponytail gonna get tangly? And also, like, because there's a wig grip under there, look at that gap. That looks fake, wiggy. Um, and certain lighting, like in the back, you know, that blends pretty good. But this, I mean, you'd have to have more um, in certain lighting, it looks okay, but like out here, it looks awful. Plus, that looks ridiculous. So, that's where oh, putting this on is just gonna help um, make it to where you can honestly just do your workout, not worry if anyone at the gym or wherever is trying to check you out. I mean, that hairline just with this wig and and this is synthetic i do i i, I want to so ellenville is a lighter piece with like no permatees so that's why i love this piece so this went like look at that ponytail if you can see that there's no bulk so tomorrow what i'm gonna do is um see and even with the wig grip there's a little bit of bulkiness but you know just just bunch it up and you know if you put it back far enough or incorporate some of your hair like hopefully your hair's longer than mine you know just like that it just kind of helps make it look more realistic you know have some um some uh sideburns out you know not a big deal uh so you know i just threw this up while i was working out because it fell off while i was working out but tomorrow I'm going to try my Alessandra by John Renault, which is a thicker, more um, billowy piece that makes my head look like a mushroom. I'm going to see how that works with the wig cap. Um, and then we'll see how it works with like just its day. So just stay tuned for uh, more workout uh, theories. One thing I want to quickly add is that using the... Um, Thing underneath the wig grip it's like just the Milano wig grip um, I was able to sorry uh, I laid on my back I did work on my back I did yoga I had my head flipped upside down and it didn't budge I didn't feel it slide or do anything that made me feel uncomfortable so uh, yeah just adding that to this um, set okay so I unintentionally went jogging I wouldn't call it running because I had just ate had a glass of wine it was my daughter we went jogging and had this hair on this is the open wifted human hair with Kyle Welch um grand entrance and uh, I just have a wig grip underneath the Milano wig grip and it didn't it didn't move at all I it felt like maybe it had, I don't know if it moved at all. It might have moved like a little bit, but honestly, I had like been laying on the ground and like all over the place with this. So if it was uh, shifted at all, I don't know. Like, and I, I did some high knees and stuff afterwards. So um, just wanted to throw that out that I wore this jogging, but it's cool weather. So um, I need to do it when it's warmer out and see how that works. So just adding this to the experiment, um, running with the open wefted human hair piece, um, in a bun like this. 
you see that one like this and um didn't uh didn't move at all um was jogging like 10 11 minute mile pace so there you go